In this video I'm going to show you how to change ownership of your YouTube channel or how to change email of your YouTube channel. For example, if you at some stage decide to buy a YouTube channel or if you would like to sell your YouTube channel, I will show you how it's done in this video. So guys, let's start and first thing what we will do, I will show you my channels if I click here on this icon on the right top corner and click here on switch account, I have here couple of channels and I will be forwarding ownership of the channel to another account to another email currently all these channels which you are seeing here in this drop down they are under email martinj.business at gmail.com as you can see here in the right top corner and for example if i decide to sell a youtube channel for example currently i am in tech wolf as you can see here here is check mark but if i would want to sell a youtube channel crypto bull all i need to do is go into the channel which i would want to switch account first, switch to that channel which I would want to sell or for which I would want to change email or which I would want to change ownership and then once as you can see currently I'm in crypto bull channel but this crypto bull channel is also under the same email. If I go into your channel here you will see that currently I'm in my other channel and this is crypto bull channel. And now let's open incognito window which is session free window and let's open gmail account and I will open another gmail account which I have created especially for the purpose of this video to which I will be changing the ownership of this channel. This is another email. If I click here you can see that here I have created an empty email which is cryptobull.business at gmail.com but if I will go into YouTube currently with this account I click on this icon if I click here on with this new one on uh, switch accounts there are no uh, no other channels there is only crypto ball which is native channel to this email address now if i would want to add my youtube channel to this email address which is cryptoball.business at gmail.com from this channel all i need to do is click here on this icon in the right top corner and then click on youtube studio click here on settings in the right bottom corner you will see this tab or button settings just click on it and it will open this pop-up on the left side you will see this navigation here select channel here on the top bar you will see basic info advanced settings featured liability click here on advanced settings and scroll down until you will see this manage youtube account remove youtube content and advanced channel settings what we need to click is manage youtube account and on this page if you scroll a little bit down here you will see channel managers and under these channel managers this is the place where we can change owner or we can or grant ownership to another person or create managers for example to if you are in at some stage want to allow some people to manage your YouTube channel for example to reply comments to do different uh, manage, manager stuff on your YouTube channel this is the place where you can do it and here you need to do is click add or remove managers and this is for crypto bull channel and we will be forwarding this from martinj.business at gmail.com to another newly created account which I already showed you which is crypto bull dot as you can see crypto bull dot business at gmail dot com and to do this first thing what we will need to do is click manage permissions as owner of this channel currently under martinj.business at gmail.com I click here on manage permissions and I have set two-factor authentication on my YouTube channel so I need to open this two-factor authentication click here 65 on my mobile and it will open and as I verify that I am currently owner and I have set two-factor authentication and here I click on manage permissions again and it will open this tab where you will see managers and owners of this particular YouTube channel which is crypto bull guys and you can see that currently this is my account and for example if you would want now to invite or grant ownership to another email address all you need to do firstly is by clicking this on this icon and here clicking add new users and here you are typing in email of the channel to which you would like to grant access or ownership of this particular channel but firstly you will not be able to grant a full ownership but you will be able to add him only as manager so so let's go and let's type in crypto.bull.business at gmail.com as you can see here crypto.bull.business at gmail.com and here at the very bottom you will see choose a role just click on this and it will own, open owner manager and communications manager but you can't grant straight away ownership of to that person that's why firstly you need to select here manager and click invite and 
Now click on done here and now what we need to do, we need to open another email. As you remember I opened it in incognito window, it is here and here you can see that that person which we are inviting now to and creating him as a manager receives email. This is this email address cryptobull.business at gmail.com. So let's open an email from here and you click here on accept invitation. Click accept this. So we become a manager now and now we can manage I will go into YouTube, YouTube account of this new account to which I added this manager permissions and here in the right top corner I will click on my icon with this new account and click here on switch accounts and now you can see that previously as you remember there were only one channel which is this default channel which I told you crypto bull but currently we can also access from this new email also crypto bull but Currently we are still not owner, we are still manager. So let's go back to our account here and here we will refresh this page. I will just refresh as I always do it and here I will click manage permissions again and now I can see that Crypto Bull is also a manager here on this side. But what I can do here now on this side is click again on this on this arrow pointing down and I can make him as owner and I click owner and make a Crypto Bull as owner of Crypto Bull. This means that if I will click here now make owner then Crypto Bull this new created email will become a full owner who will be able to do anything with that account. If he will be able to delete it as you can see as an owner account owner crypto bull can add, add and delete other owners and managers change account permissions including yours this means me he can remove me fully from this newly created channel and delete this account completely so he can create if I make him an owner he can delete crypto bull channel completely so let's make him an owner Let's click on done and now let's go back to another to cryptobull.business account as you remember here guys if I will refresh this page just just to make sure that all changes take place and now let's check uh, if I can remove my other account from here click on switch accounts click on click on crypto bull so we are now in the settings of this account from here what we need to do now click on this icon and click here on YouTube Studio. So with this new elite created email we are going into YouTube Studio and we will be accessing manager permissions again now from this crypto bull but already from this new email address. And now let's open this and let's go into settings as we did before and on this page we are going into channel and on this page which opens up we click into advanced settings we scroll down we go into manage youtube account here we scroll a little bit down and as you remember change managers click here on add remove managers click on manage permissions and we click manage permissions and here as you can see uh, you this is me currently I am owner of this particular account guys but one thing which I wanted to uh, to note about all this ownership and changing and everything what is happening here guys is that if, as you can see here currently I am owner I can do pretty much everything with this channel what I want but primary owner of the channel which is the very beginning very beginner who created this channel at the very start guys still is that person who under which email originally this channel was created which is martinsh.business at gmail.com but we got ownership under this newly created uh, email address cryptobull.business at gmail.com here you can see that still we are the owner we can do everything with the channel but still primary owner stays the same person who created this channel from the very beginning this means that if you are buying ever a youtube channel guys don't rely only on ownership but always ask for the email under which that particular channel was created and only then you will be primary owner so uh, if that email if that channel originally was created under martins.business at gmail.com guys and you would want 
to buy a YouTube channel, then you should get a all email address as well under which this channel was created originally. Only then you will have full access to that YouTube channel and only then you will be a primary owner and only then that primary owner will not be able to delete you at some stage. Or if you will do it exactly the same way as I did it in this video, I, I got only ownership, all I could do is delete the channel. But for example, if I buy a channel from someone and th still the primary email uh, stays with that person from who I bought this, uh, this YouTube channel, guys. And in future, maybe I make this channel very popular, he can delete me at any time. He can delete me and remove me as owner of this my own channel for which I got just ownership. So remember guys always whenever you are buying a YouTube channel get the full ownership of that particular YouTube channel. Get it, the, get the original email and password under the, which that channel was created and only then you will have 100% ownership of that channel because then you just change uh, change a password and that person who sold you this channel and email account and all Google account he will not be able to access any information. So yes guys I hope that you found this video interesting useful and if you did leave a like share this video subscribe to my channel if you are new and see you in the next one.